So hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be really simple and short. I wanted to share my top five um, drugstore products with you that like I can't really live without. I've used these things like from the beginning and they've been with me ever since. And when you find a product that you truly, truly love, you want to like kind of share it and give people your secrets so they can use it and find the same things that you find. I've been really into using my drugstore products a lot lately and although I do love like higher end stuff it's just sometimes or I just tend to go back to my drugstore things. So I thought this would be like a kind of cool video to like share with you guys like the five top things that like I literally cannot be without. Yeah so let's just jump right into it. Like I said it'll be super short and simple but I wanted to get a video out for you guys today and like I was like thinking about this in my head last night because I was like trying to think of a video I can do for you guys. Although I do want to do holiday looks, that is coming, but I wanted to share a video that can let you guys know a little bit of like information or like products that you should purchase. So let me just go ahead and jump into it, like I said. So the first, first product is something like I absolutely cannot live without, and I've worn this since high school. It is basically my L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black, and me, I have medium length eyelashes and I absolutely love this mascara. It's super black so I love when you can really see the contrast of your eyelashes so I like having really black eyelashes and this does that. It gives you length like literally people think I'm wearing fake eyelashes when I'm wearing this stuff but no it's just mascara and it gives you a little bit of fullness. I know we don't like our eyelashes clumpy but I do like that fullness and a little bit of clump so if you want that then you just do about like three coats. Two coats will make them nice and like flary and full but three coats will give you a little bit more of a drastic look and that's what I like going for. So number one is this mascara and I think like every girl should have this if you are a mascara chick. So that's number one. Number two is something like I've been super excited about ever since I used, well not ever since I used it, but I used it in my last tutorial, but it's not up yet, but you guys will see. It's this new Instant Age Rewind Eraser Dark Circle Treatment Color Concealer. And I have the color Light Pale. It's like already almost gone, but I have like dark circles. Like I don't get like puffiness, but like if I wake up, even if I've gotten eight hours of sleep, like I'll still have like some purpleness around here. And I always have to wear concealer. Like sometimes I don't wear it, but like I always feel like I need to wear it because I like to cover up these dark circles. And this like covers it up so well. It, a little bit goes a long way. And it gives you just that nice brightness under your eyes. It's just perfect for like lighter to medium skin tones. And yeah, it just gives you a really good coverage. I've been using the MAC Pro Long Wear Concealer and this, I prefer this over that. Um, it's just it's just like the perfect color. It's not too pink, it's not too young yellow. It just gives you that perfect like Kim K highlight glow. So I love using this under my eyes and this is light pale. And yeah, this is definitely another thing that I would definitely say every girl should have especially if you're into that concealer and highlighting and contouring thing. So that was number two. Number three is this NYX and this is the Butter Gloss and this is in Apple Strudel and I have like a lot of these and Eclair used to be in my number one but this one I've really really been loving like it looks peachy but it's just I'm wearing it right now on my lips over the next product that I'm going to be talking about. You can wear it by itself or you can wear it over top any single lipstick and it just gives that extra like glossiness. Like literally, seriously all their lip glosses are really really good. So like I recommend all of them but this color just stands out a lot to me and I really really love it and it's one of my faves. I always throw this in my purse and I definitely think everybody should have this. Sorry I'm kind of like sick but hopefully I don't sound like. Next is another NYX product. And this is in Summer Love, and it's just a really nice nude color. Sorry, like, the lighting's kind of crazy. It's dark outside, so I have my light on. Just the perfect nude. Like, you, I'm wearing it under the Apple Strudel, and I just love the, like, pinkish, nudish color it gives off. But even if you wear this along with the smoky eye, this is, like, one of those perfect nudes that you want to find and you want to keep. And you can wear with any type of look, and it doesn't wash you out too much. 
So yeah, I just wanted to mention this because this is one of my favorites. And last but not least is probably one of my all-time favorites too. I seriously cannot live without this. I've tried lots of liners. I have the Inglot Gel Liner 77, a brush that you apply. And this still beats out any like higher-end product that I've ever put glossy but it just gives you the perfect finish for eyeliner it's just perfect I'm wearing that on my eyes today well kind of scared me my heater just went on it gives a nice finish it gives, it's not hard it's very easy to use so I think this would be perfect for beginners because it's really easy to like use um, when you're putting on eyeliner I don't know I just really love this product it's carbon black it's super black it's glossy it gives a perfect winged liner um, so yeah, I know a lot of people like this stuff too, but the carbon black one works really, really well and it's one of my top favorite products that I wanted to share with you guys. So those were my five little secret products that I wanted to share with you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this and I know this video was super short, but don't worry because I'm going to be having some holiday glam looks and I can't wait to share that with you. And I am vlogging for Vlogmas, um, but... I don't do stuff every day so like sometimes I don't feel like I should like film because then it'll probably just like bore you guys so I am gonna be putting up a few like vlogmas um, videos uh, I hope you guys enjoy it and don't forget to leave me all your comments and suggestions down below I love interacting with you guys all and if you're new go ahead and subscribe just so you can be updated on all my new videos I hope you guys enjoyed this and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys